Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be playing a $5 sit and go. Uh, first place gets $18, second place gets $10. So let's get started. Ooh, here we go. King Queen offsuit. So we are currently practicing uh, just so that we can play in real life poker once this casino is finally opened some point this year. I'm going to guess like towards the end of this year is when the casino is going to be open. So might actually be able to play live poker for you guys. And oh my gosh, we just flopped the street. Wow, that's incredible. Okay, so checks back to us. I mean, that's to be expected at this point. Let's see here. Uh, we're just going to go with the C bet here. Let's go with four. I'm predicting everyone's going to fold at this point. I mean, I guess, oh, this guy's going to keep going. They're probably going to check, but they're going to bet 21. I'm going to guess they're going for the flush or they might have a nine. Um, at this point, I mean, it's not that unreasonable to just kind of shove into this guy with like 21 bigs. Let's go. He's either going to fold here or he's going to shove. Oh, let's see it. He had nothing. What? Then why did you continue? That doesn't. <laughs> what? I don't understand why he did that. All right. A7 suited. Let's go with a three. He pretty much just gave me his entire stack. That doesn't make any sense. King five. Oh, this guy's going for the raise at this point. I mean, do we continue with A7? A7 suit. I mean, we have enough bigs at this point, so it's not that unreasonable for us to continue. So we're probably just going to call it. Let's see. Okay, since this guy raised pre flop, we're going to check it to him. Okay, going with the 18 bit. We're going to fold here. Pocket kings. All right, makes sense for him to do what he did. Does not make sense for this guy. No idea what happened there, so that was that was very odd. Okay, 10-5 on the big. Do we defend the big? Let's defend the big against one other person. Let's try to scare him out. Go with a three bet here. Okay, he calls. At this point, if I continue to C bet, we might be able to get him out. Let's go with a four. A little over half the pot. I might scare him off, oh, unless he's actually chasing something. At this point, I have a pair of fives. He checks to me. Could show weakness. I mean, he might actually have something decent, so we're just going to check back and see what we have going on during the showdown. Checks to me. Uh, we'll check it right back. He could just have overcards. All right, yep, he had absolutely nothing, but just was hoping to land the high pair. Ooh, here we go. King, queen, an early position. Let's go with a three bet here. All right, this guy is calling on the button. Two people playing at this point. Could try to go for the flush, or somebody could be trying to go for the flush with clovers. This guy's taking a decent while to actually go. He just took a long time to check. Not, feel, not having a good feeling about that. Uh, we're just going to think about it for a second. And I mean, at this point, I guess we could potentially land a straight. I mean, we have to have exactly the right card, so we're just going to check it. I'm betting we yep, Anthony's gonna bet here. Three bigs. I feel like Steve's gonna raise. I feel he landed something good. So we're probably gonna fold it off here. Let's see, ace king suited. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's gonna be great. Uh we're pretty much known at this point. Set the standard for the three bet, so drop the three bet. Okay, when I called, nice, nice. Could have an opportunity to take another person off out of here if we actually land the nuts okay up against the same two people here let's see you guys are both checking to me at this point i feel like you guys want me to bet i mean it's not reasonable let's go with go with a four uh just so that they might see that i'm trying to bet for value and get, get a little freaked out okay so this guy clearly has something he is working towards could be working towards the flush Okay, we got one guy out at least. Okay, I have a feeling this guy might have tens. Could have tens. Uh, at this point, it might be wise to just check it. Okay, we have nothing. I wonder if he's going to... Wow, he's going to go with nine. We have okay showdown value. I'm guessing he had like pocket pairs or something. We're just going to dip out of there. Ace five suited. All right, very nice, very nice. And we're on the big. Okay, so it's going to be just versus one guy. Let's go with a three bet. 
Increase the sizing of the pot a little bit. Ooh, we have a flush draw here. So let's see if we could just bet four. See if we'll continue with this one. Okay, you got the call. Uh, at this point, again, backdoor is there. Let's go with... If I bet half the pot, I feel like that will incentivize him to just kind of shove it on me there. So we're just going to bet five. And hope he doesn't go for the shove. Okay. So at this point, we landed nothing. Uh, he could shove into me here. If we check it, even if we bet, we could be just getting called with nothing. I feel like he at least has a pair of something. So we're just going to check right here. Hope he checks back. Showdown value. Oh, he's got the jacks. Nice. Okay, pocket tens. Pocket tens on the small. Okay, let's play this and hope we could land the set. Goes with that. Let's go with a call here. Or not a call, a uh, three bet. One guy to fold. This guy shoves into me. We'll definitely call at this point with pocket tens. Thinking about it. Oh my goodness, I hope he doesn't have like pocket jacks, queens, or kings. That'd be horrible. Oh, he's. He, he might shove at the very end. Oh, he just calls. Okay. Ooh, landed two pair. Is he good enough to just kind of be playing this with this, the queen? Let's see. Is it four? Oh, he folds. All right. A six suited. Okay. Uh, we're in early position. Let's see if we could just get the limp in here. Oh, wow. Two people fold right after me. All right. Nice. Going to be a cheap buy here. Okay. Check. Okay. Well, might as well double the pot. See how these guys react to that. Assume if they're not working towards anything, they'll probably fold. I mean, it's a rainbow board unless you have a king. Okay. Let's see here. 10 jack. Okay. Could be going for the straight at this point. I'm a little worried about this guy. He's going to wait for his shove hand and then just... Okay, he's just going to do that. Uh, let's go to 2.5. Big raise. Let's see. They probably haven't seen the sizing before, so they should be like, what in the world? Why is he doing it that way? Okay, just 100. All right, cool. Everyone's in. Ooh, chances for the straight is definitely there. Someone could be trying to chase the flush with diamonds very possible so we would need a king or an eight wait doesn't need guess there yeah okay uh let's go with a three everyone's gonna fold on this if he shoves we'll call because we do have some outs here so we'll see he could just have an ace could just have a queen oh wow Ooh, ace jack suited. I like this. Wouldn't mind if anyone shoved into us. Either this guy or this guy, because yeah, I'm covered. Uh, with three. Ooh, didn't get anything out of that one. All right. All right, we got four, six offsuit. If it comes down just me and this guy, I could shove, and then I'll probably get him to fold unless he has something awesome. Let's see, he just calls. He just called. I mean, at this point, this might scare him off. That's the only reason I'm doing this, and I haven't covered by so much that I think he might just drop it here. But let's see. All in. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, boy. What do we got? It's just a chop. All right. Yep, that works. <laughs> we both have horrible cards. He's like, ah, not just going to waste it and just go out like that. That's admirable. I like that. That was funny. All in shove. I mean, we got three, three, five offsuit. Might as well let this guy take it. Jack eight. Jack eight. Wow, what in the world? That's so weird. Okay. Yeah, there he goes. All right, down to four. Okay, ten six. Ten six suited. We're on the small. All right, could we just limp in on this one? Is that possible? Let's just see if we can. All right. Well, we need a nine, and that would be fantastic. Uh, let's just go for the two bet here. A fold. I think a fold. Oh, 
We got two pair. All right, looking real nice uh, at this point. Go with a 3.5. Go for that. See how Anthony, if he tries to shove in on me here, we'll definitely call. I mean, a chance that he could have a straight. Oh, well, I just want to not to get too cocky to have like high stack. And I know some people with high stack, they play very loosely. So we're not going to do that. I mean, five, six suited. That is a great hand to play. You can't just not. We're just going to limp in here in early position. Let's see how everyone else plays. Okay. Because at this point, I'm, I'm still very concerned that at any point somebody could shove in and we'll just be like, I have no idea what to do. <laughs> um, we got a pair of sixes. Very easy for somebody to have overs. So little pair there, not not the best hand I could have. Everyone is just checking through though, so we might throw in a raise here. Let's see how they react. I mean, a two two big raise wouldn't be that unreasonable, but he he took a long time to figure that out. Can't tell if he was trying to figure out if he wanted to. Um, go for the bluff or not. Let's just go for the 1.5 raise here. Uh, I was like freaking him out a little bit with just the 0.5. Might mess with some people. Also, it's just a half pot bet. Okay, we'll take that one too. Ace queen suited. Nice. All right. I like where we're at here. I hope he shoves in on us here. I'm gonna do it. Just gonna bet one. Let's do a three bet here. Oh, he folds. Come on. That was such a premium hand. So sad we didn't get to utilize it. Ooh, Jack Ace. Okay. Up against this guy here. I mean, let's go for the three bet. Shoves in. We'll definitely call in this situation. Okay, nope. Ooh, lucky ladies. Uh, Let's see here. Just due to the sizing of everything, we're just going to go with a two bet here. So we get somebody to play with us. No, please. Come on. Shove. Shove. Shove in. Come on. Let's do it. Make it happen. All in. Yes. Here we go. What do you got? King six. What a weird. I mean, all right. We just got to hold. Hold. Yes. All right. But that's so weird. Why do you play those? Okay. Uh, Jack deuce. That's going to fold here. Give it to him. All right, take out one more guy, and then we just get paid indefinitely. Ooh, pair of six, or pair of nines. Mm, go with a raise. If Anthony tries shoving in on us here, if he does, we'll call. Yep, all right, let's go. Nines, if we get another nine, that'd be awesome. Just got to make sure the ace doesn't pop. Nice, there it is. All right, heads up. We're guaranteed to be paid at this point at least uh, five dollars out of this game, so our bankroll will be up to like fifteen bucks here after this, at least. Mm. Deuce Jack. All right, we'll call here. I mean, it's, it's heads up. So, ooh, backdoor flush. Um, let's go with a check here. See how he plays it. How big are you gonna raise? Wow. Okay, yeah, we'll be out. We'll be out of that one. You could have the Queen of Hearts. In which case, eh, let's see here, seven jack, seven jack. Yeah, we're just gonna play a little abnormally, abnormally here just because it is heads up. Okay, king jack. Oh, he just folds real quick there. Okay, three nine, three nine. This isn't a real playable hand, so we're just gonna drop it. Nine three again, okay. Glad he just folded to us there. Ooh, King Ace. All right, all right. For the three bet, he'll probably fold. Yep. Ooh, Ace. Oh, no. <laughs> Come on, guy. Ah, oh, man. Ah. Uh, Jack. Let's do it again. Please don't shove. Okay. Ooh, pocket tens. I hope he does go for the shove here. Unless he has a bigger pocket pair, then, you know, that's of concern, but take that one as well. Deuce, queen. Uh, we're just going to fold there. Let's see here. Nine, eight. Ah, I hate that spot. Okay, cool, cool. Didn't have to make us think about it. Yep, that one's a pretty easy one as well. Okay, we need, all right, that's playable. 
Hmm. Could land a straight here shortly. That one. Let's get one. It could appear to be a value bet. We got him off relatively cheap there. He could have a little pair. Uh, check. In case weakness, he might try to bet me here. Ooh, he could have the flush. Mm, I feel like he might have overcards. I, I feel like he could have a pair of nines, a pair of tens. We're just going to check it here. See if he tries to bet. If he bets, we'll be out. But he just bets too. I feel like that's a value bet. Let him have it. Okay. Or deuce. We'll fold there. Ooh, 9-10, okay. Straight potential. Let's check it. Let's see here. All we need is an 8. Need to make the straight. Go with 1. All-in shove. What do you have? What do you have here? Did you land a set? Yeah, uh, yeah. Let's give it to you. Man. Back size is about to be even here shortly. I will right, raise it to 2. 9-ace. Okay. I three. Oh, quick fold there. Ooh, here we go. Go with three bet. If he shoves, we'll play. Called on that one. Could land a straight. Ah, oh, man. That is quite a spot to be in. Either has aces or queens. No reason to play this. No reason. You could land a 10 and get the straight, but that just gives you four outs. I mean... That's assuming they have the ace or the queen there. It just, I don't like it. 10 king. Go throw in the three here. He calls. Okay, we'll check. Is he really going to pull that move off every time? Does he really have anything? Then again, our showdown value would be high king. I really don't want to fold this. But I... Rainbow board, you can't, you can't. This guy's got me over a barrel here. Mm, uh, almost did that, let's go with a three. <laughs> oh, almost just shoved into him with a uh, seven, five suited. That would be ridiculous to play, but okay. Yeah, we're pretty much even stack size at this point. Let him catch up. That is just all on me. Very poor playing here on heads up, but... This is how it is. Ooh, queen. <laughs> Dang it. Not letting me play the premium hands. Uh, four not. No way. I feel like at this point we're both waiting for a good shove hand for the other person. Uh, ace, deuce. All right, we'll play. Got a pair of deuces. Probably going to shove here for un some unknown reason. Oh, he just checked. He's waiting for me to make my move, and then he's going to shove because he knows I'll fold to that. Uh, let's just check. We'll probably take it here and show down. Hmm. Wouldn't it be a horrible to call? Deuces. Let's do it. Yeah, you had nothing. All right. Let's see. A seven, seven king. Just based on the way he was betting, I knew he, had, he didn't have anything, so. Hmm. We're going to fold there. Seven king. Seven king off. No reason to play that. I know my range, like for uh, heads up, is pretty tight. So we need to loosen up the range a little bit as we're getting back into it. But I just like taking breaks from playing poker, just so I'm not like you know addicted to gambling or anything like that. So that's why you'll see um, long time spans in between uploads. Let's see nine six nine six. Not a playable hand for me. I'm just waiting for him to make a major mistake at this point. I feel like there are times where I could have made a major mistake and gave him like half over half my stack. So, all right, uh, let's go with a two bet here. Two four suited could land a straight. Almost all the low cards should help me in the deck. Hmm. Folds to that. Okay, queen deuce suited. Uh, a few limbs in here will play, but okay. Yikes. Okay, anything that he could do at this point, we will fold. I mean, we could still get the flush, but it's not not looking good. Ooh, flush is there. Let's go with a 1.5 raise. 
Yeah, that that just weirds people out. People don't like that for some reason. <laughs> um, let's see here, five three. We'll fold there. All right, we're about uh, two x is stack almost. Yep, getting there. Six five. All right, let's go with the two bet here. Not like that. Okay, we're slowly bleeding them out at this point. I mean, at one point we were like, you know, pretty much same stack, but now we're we're taking away a little bit here. So he's gonna start getting pretty aggressive. So we gotta be careful um, at which hands we're playing, which ones we're not. Let's right, go for the two here. See if he has a good enough hand to shove. Okay, he does not. He's waiting for it. Whenever he shoves, you know it will just be out. But ooh, unless it's this hand. Get him to shove here, see if we can end it. Ooh, here we go. Oh, we got the ace. Here we go. Let's hold. Yes. All right, we got it. We got the winner here, and the bankroll went from $5 to $22.99, which is awesome. So we're going to continue uh, the sit and go series. So if you're new to this channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. If you enjoy the video, be sure to hit that like button. And at this point, I'm just trying to see how much money I can make from gambling in the year of 2021. So it's not going to be an official series, but I'll always have the profit and loss, overall profit and loss of this year at the very top right. So we're going to be playing blackjack and poker.